So after so long awaiting, Arbica have finally brought them out. These are the rechargeable grips for the Quest 3. Now I used to have them on the Quest 2 and they were absolutely fire. Just knowing that I had them charged and ready to go without having to change batteries and then running out and all that good stuff. I was waiting for the Quest 3 ones and another bonus about these is they fit within the Cybercore. If you haven't seen that video, I'll leave it linked here or at the end of the video. But these fit inside the Cybercore so you can have it all as one ecosystem. But before we do jump into the video of showing these off, I want to mention they are now doing a deal that if you buy a Cybercore, you will get a free pair of rechargeable grip. But anyway, without further ado, let's read over some specs that are on the box here. So these are eco-friendly, and the reason is because you're using rechargeable batteries, you're no longer throwing old ones out, which is damaging the earth. Comfort and secure with the ergonomic design and special textures for a better hold. These are also over 24 hours of use, so it means you can play longer because a standard quest normally lasts around two hours, and then obviously if you've got battery packs and things like that, you don't want your Quest controllers dying before your headset, so over 24 hours of use is incredible. And also the way that the grips are made, it's lag-free gaming, obviously improving your latency and performance. And then your charging indicator, which is a huge, huge win for me because the Quest 2 version didn't have this, but on this version they have a nice little LED to let you know when your controllers are fully charged. But even though I think in the last video about the Cybercore, it had a safe charging feature that if it came to being fully charged, it would stop charging. Don't hold me to that, but if it is true, then this just this is like the duo. This is like the perfect combination for your Quest 3 item. But that's pretty much all the specs. Now let's actually move on to the product itself so we don't need the box no more. So when it comes to the grips themselves, the build quality is fantastic. Whatever material they are using, it feels super smooth and gives you amazing grip. Now obviously it does have the hand straps. Over time that might get a bit sweaty and start to give you some sort of uncomfort. But for me, I found that these were a lot more comfortable than just using your standard everyday Quest little ropes. Obviously there is that dilemma of if you have these attached to your hands, you can't use any other features. Like say if you wanted to go into pass view and use your phone or your laptop, whatever it is, you have these stuck to your hands, so you will have to slide them on and off, but they are very easy to do so if you need to. Now with the quality of these, I can't fault them. The lights telling you that they are charged and when they need charging is absolutely fantastic. I don't know if they have a feature that when they are starting to die, they flash a color. That would be pretty cool if they did have that, but for me, I haven't noticed anything about that. I've been playing now for around two to three hours, and I've found that they haven't had any issue with batteries cutting in or out, or any latency or any movement within the tracking features. So so that is a huge win on their behalf as I do know some controllers out there that have these grips it's, it's blocking the infrared to the quest and you do get that slight delay or latency with these I haven't found that now obviously I have worked with Arbica for quite a while on a lot of their products and every time they seem to surprise me with their new stuff so from the cyber core to the head strap with the battery that worked on the quest 3 while others out there didn't even fill the charge bar Arbica was out there making waves and they still are today so you grab yourself a Cybercore grab yourself a pair of grips that are rechargeable save your batteries save your money because once you've made this investment that's all you're going to need you can charge your Quest 3 your Quest 2 your Pico 4 whatever you have your Apple Vision all within this ecosystem of the Cybercore, which is absolutely a win on their behalf. And if I have any discounts for you, they will be linked in the description, but all links are down there, so you can go check it for yourself. You can also get these grips on their own. You don't have to get the Cybercore, so again, that link will be down there too. I wanna to say a huge thank you to Arbica for sponsoring this video and many others, and they don't have any creative control or what I say about their product, so this is all coming from someone that's used their products for a long time and really enjoy working with a company that know what they're doing when it comes to Quest 3 or any Quest out there. And also, if you've noticed the little orange strap on my Quest, that is also Arbica. So just go check out their whole website, basically, because they have a crazy amount of stuff. But other than that, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Or if you would pick this up yourself because it just looks cool, a bit Iron Man-ish, you know, leave it in the comments as well about your thoughts on the Cybercore and the grips included. Remember, as always, capture, create, captivate, and I'll see you all in the next video.